Predecessor vs Successor. It is the Oppo F3 vs the Oppo F5 for this comparison video. Being birds of the same feather, design is all but similar. The F5 is slightly bigger with its 6-inch 18x9 display and a more defined rear. Down to the ports, speaker grille and camera placement are the same. Another glaring difference would be the transfer of the fingerprint scanner to the back for better ergonomics. Even with their SIM trays, both can concurrently accommodate two nano SIMs and a micro SD card. Going with the numbers, the F5's 18x9 display looks sharper, crisper, and obviously larger. Viewing experience may vary considering that colors do look overly similar to the Oppo F3. Both have night modes for those uninterrupted late night marathons or chat sessions. Even up to the maximum brightness, they're one and the same. The jump from Color OS version 3.0 to 3.2 may not seem that much, but the latest version definitely feels smoother. Not only that, the included features for Nougat are also present on the Oppo's latest ROM. Before we get into comparing the results, let's take a peek at the specs, shall we? Oppo can confidently say that their cameras have stepped up too. From daylight to night shots, the new cameras that they have for the F5, even with the absence of a wide-angle front camera, are fitting for the price it is offered for. Videos may be a hit or miss for most since they still are pretty similar to the two generations of the F series. Selfies on the other hand has more than stepped up, especially with the introduction of depth effect, bokeh, or portrait mode. Since the Oppo F5 that we have is not the retail version, benchmarks that require an internet connection either run poorly or do not even initiate due to manufacturer restrictions. The difference is significant between the raw performance in both synthetic benchmarks and real-world usage. Although both may hold similar battery packs, the F3 lasted for a bit longer in our battery test. The only culprit for the F5 would be its more resource-intensive hardware, which is an obvious trade-off. And even with similar packs, the F5 charges 15% faster than the F3 with the same 10 watts adapter. So to speak, the speakers aren't any different. They're virtually the one and the same with the same clarity and room volume. I still frame photographs of you and me together is all I have of you. I still frame photographs of you and me together It's all I have of you and me anymore What both the F3 and F5 have going for themselves is their customizable EQ and real sound tech, co-developed with the rack. And if you're into karaoke or recording vocals with your phone, the F5 allows for live monitoring. If you're on the fence for an Oppo phone, the F5 is definitely a winner. What did you like more? Is it the Oppo F3 or the Oppo F5? Let us know in the comment section below and click the subscribe button for more videos like this. This has been Rain of Manila Shaker. Thank you for watching.